hi lovelies welcome back to ug update so guys on this video we are going to be talking about destined by fate series guys and we're talking about an upcoming episode which is actually going to be coming up in the destined by fate series pretty very soon and that's about sarut's dilemma guys let's dive straight into the video to find out exactly what will be going down on this episode but before that please don't forget this is the ug update in case if you are yet to subscribe please click on the subscription button and subscribe don't also forget to give this video a thumbs up all right guys without wasting more time let's dive straight into the video so guys the episode starts with sayuri tells kanha that she must have imagined something and troubled him and the family that she goes to get ready for breakfast then at the dining hall rashmi says kanha and sayuri didn't come down yet as maybe Sayuri is still feeling weak, so she will take breakfast to Sayuri to her room. Sayuri gets ready and tells Kanha that they should go down now. Then Kanha replaces her bindi and says he has another surprise for her. Rashmi walks in with breakfast and says since Sayuri must be feeling weak and wants rest, she brought breakfast for her. Then Sayuri says she is fine and would have breakfast with the family, so Kanha says the same. Rashmi frowns but agrees and takes the breakfast back. Then Sayuri joins the family. She hands over Mitu to Kanha and says she will serve breakfast today. Saro refuses to accept the breakfast from her and says she is not yet hungry. Then Ted says breakfast became thirsty with Sayuri's torch. He will be more happy if he gets tea. So Darad says she still remembers Sayuri's tea taste. Then Sayuri remembers preparing tea for two days and leaving it in the Tamos flask for Danraj. Then she says she will serve them tea and pakoras with special chutney in the evening. Ted says he will enjoy pakoras and tea. Then there are the mouses called him that sweet and oily food is prohibited for him. Then he says even sugar glass tea tastes good from Sayuri's hands. Kaha apologizes to Naku for being rude to him in the recent past and promises to accompany him to work soon. Naku hugs him and says he didn't feel bad. Rashmi gets jealous seeing their growing bond and her plan failing. Then she thinks she needs to emotionally blackmail Sayuri and stop her from revealing the truth to the family. So she carries her son to Sayuri's room and pleads to forgive her for her son's sake. Then Sayuri says she will expose her lies at the right time. So Rashmi says even now is the right time as it did a year ago. She wanted to reveal the truth herself but stopped because of her son. She continues to emotionally blackmail Sayuri and then requests her to hide the truth for her son's sake. Sayuri takes Arjun in the hands and says a mother is defeated by a sister. So she suffers separation from her daughter because of Rashmi but will hide the truth for Arjun's sake. Rashmi thanks her for maintaining the secret and tries to hug her for forgiving her. Then Sayuri stops her and says she will never forgive her for her heinous act but will maintain silence. Then Saro demands Kanha to get his and Mitu's DNA test done as she cannot live without a doubt in her mind. Then Kanha is shocked and refuses her plea. She continues to pester him and walks behind but Sayuri hears their conversation. So guys, this is what went down on this episode and you can see that Rashmi is trying to blackmail Sayuri emotionally not to reveal the truth. And at the same time, Saroj is still trying to pester Kanha to, to perform a DNA test between him and Mitsu, but Kanha still refuses her plea. Guys, what do you think about this episode? Please drop what you think about this episode on the comment section. And as you do that, please don't forget, this is the UG update in case if you are yet to subscribe, please click on the subscription button and subscribe. Don't also forget to give this video a thumbs up. Alright guys, that will be a wrap. Thank you guys for watching up to this point. You guys have been amazing. I love you guys and I will see you guys in my next video.